Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, we'll show you how to install third-party apps for users and teams. This video will cover three topics. First, the difference between an add-on and an add-on. Second, how to install third-party apps in Microsoft Teams. And thirdly, we'll look at some of the best add-ins to improve Microsoft Teams. Add-ins and add-ons are both designed to expand and improve the functionality of an application. But there's a difference. Add-ins are generally independent applications that can be connected to other apps to expand their functionality. Whereas add-ons are generally scripts or extensions that expand the functionality of an application, but is not an independent application itself. Now that's cleared up, let's look at how to install a third-party app for Microsoft Teams. While owners can restrict which apps can be added in Microsoft Teams, you can generally add apps by selecting a channel and hitting the plus icon. If you want more options, such as the ability to add an app to a chat, then go to apps in the left menu. There, search for an app you want to add. Then select the app. Next, click the drop down arrow on the add button. You can now choose to add the app to a team, chat, or a meeting. But in this video, we'll focus on how to add a pinned app for all users on the left menu. To do that, you'll need admin permissions to change or create the app setup policy. To start, open your admin center and click the menu icon in the top left. If you can't see teams on the menu, click show all. And then select teams from the revealed options. In the Teams Admin Center, click the menu icon in the top left. Then go down to Teams Apps. Then select Setup Policies from the revealed options. Now click on your global policy. Proceed by clicking the Add Apps button. Then simply type in the name of the app you'd like to add. Next, hover over the app and click Add. And click Add again at the bottom. Now head down to Pinned Apps. Here, click Add Apps. Enter the name of the app. Then hover over and click Add. And again click Add at the bottom. You can now hit Save. And then confirm to finish the process. When you return to Teams, you can now find your app by clicking the three dots on the left menu. Simply click the app to add it to your Microsoft Teams environment. Now you know how to add apps in Microsoft Teams, let's look at some productivity boosting apps you should know about. First is Polly. Polly is an engagement tool that allows you to get feedback from your team in the form of polls and surveys. Prezi Video is great for making video responses in Teams and sending them directly to chats and channels. You can even add media to the videos from a host of stock images. Stack Overflow is essential if you have a large and constantly developing knowledge base. Members can ask and answer questions, and gain points for providing answers to become an expert. And when old answers become obsolete, you get notified, so the team is always up to date. WorkStreams is a brilliant task management tool that works a lot like Trello. You can simply drag tasks to the completed section, and prioritize the tasks that need urgent attention. That's all for this video. We hope it was helpful. Check the description for additional links and resources. And leave a comment below if you have any concerns or questions. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.